Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. My dear brothers and sisters, we read this word of God from the Gospel of Luke chapter 15 verse 11 onwards. We have reflected about this many times but let's continue reflecting because the prodigal son story has got an enormous amount of um, messages which we can't even imagine. So many messages. I myself has given so many talks about this prodigal son story. and imagine how much more how depth how deep this parable is then jesus said there was a man who had two sons was 12 the younger of them said to his father father give me the share of the property that will belong to me so he divided his property between them my dear brothers and sisters listen very carefully The younger of them said give me the share of the property that will belong to me he divided his property and got it what is the attitude of this younger brother younger son is he, this younger son his attitude is he doesn't want his father he only wants the gift of the father what does it mean he think he thinks that he can manage with the gifts even if the relationship is not there He doesn't bother about the relationship between he and his father but he is only bothered about the relationship between he and the gifts of the father my brothers and sisters he thought he can manage he thought he can live a beautiful life with these gifts he thought he can enjoy his life with these gifts He thought he can get so many connections and friendships and so many will be there after him with these gifts. He thought the rest of his life is secure and sound and safe with these gifts. And therefore he didn't value his relationship with his father. He only valued the gift of the father. And he went out. He started enjoying the gifts within no time. all what he depended all the gifts that he depended he lost it my brothers and sisters this is exactly what happens to us when we give more value for the gifts than the relationship with the father relationship with the father is more important than the relationship of, of the, uh, the relationship with the father is more important than the gifts of the father which he did not realize he thought he can manage he can manage he went after the gifts at the end he lost everything at the end he was in the pig sty when he was in the pig sty suddenly he remembered a relationship my father my father is there then he came back he got everything back my dear brothers and sisters all those who love the gifts of the father more than the father you will lose the gifts when you remember the father your relationship you will gain everything so this is what we need to remember do you really value the gift or the father if you value the gift you will lose the gift if you fa- value the father you will gain everything else through jesus christ we have a relationship jesus who comes inside of us is asking us to enter into a relationship what kind of relationship you are no more just a creature you are a child of god and you have a father in heaven therefore value this relationship you are safe give importance for this relationship your whole life will be safe give importance for this relationship more than the gifts you will be at peace you will enjoy your life you will rejoice always my dear brothers and sisters let us stop running after the gifts of this world gifts of the father let us run after the father you know that the prodigal son when he was in the pig sty he remembered his father this is very important the lord is telling us give importance for the relationship tell him lord 
I know that I have a relationship between you and me Lord it is not just an idea but it is a real real reality reality of a relationship i thank you father